corporate governance is a recurring theme in my talks and it's something I feel quite passionate about because it's really important. If we're going to raise the standard of living, increase the GDP per capita, which is important in terms of educational provision, health service provision, whole range of activities, we need to get better performance out of the private sector and the public sector. The number of times I pick up the newspaper and see uh, issues raised about poor spending in local government, projects that have gone astray, and I think to myself, is it only after the event that the directors hear about this? What sort of corporate governance is in place if we don't know about things well in advance? It shouldn't be reported in the press and then have local government councillors saying, oh, this is absolutely awful. So I am concerned with corporate governance and we have done a lot of work in this area in recent years. So we've linked at the bottom of the IBR webpage a number of studies that have been undertaken here in New Zealand and elsewhere. Last week I was down at the University of Otago at a symposium on corporate governance as a speaker and again the recurring themes seem to be well we ought to do this, we ought to do that. Whereas as a positivist, my studies are about looking at large samples and saying, well, what are the relationships? What have we found that works? And I think this is an important contribution, that companies, local government, central government, departments and ministries of state need to have good governance models, and that's one way in which the performance will be lifted and it will have positive outcomes for our people.